Welcome to .sub. In this tutorial, we're going to show you how to translate a video and create subtitles using .sub. First thing that has to happen, you must be logged in as a .sub user, and if you don't have an account, you would see register here in the upper right. Just click on that, and you can set up an account. In order to transcribe or translate, you do have to be a registered user. Uh, we click on the video you want to translate, then look to the right of the player, the blue tab that says translate, transcribe and here is the language selection list. We're going to click on the menu and you can type in the first few letters of the language. Let's say it's French and it takes you to the versions of French we have and I'm going to choose French for France. Once you select that you click the yellow translate button. This is taking you to our translation user interface. You'll see the source language, in this case it's English, in black and then in blue it says click to translate into French. So you click on this line and you just t translate the first line. The first line. If I was typing in French, that would be in French. You hit the enter key on your keyboard and that saves your work and then you type the next line. The next line. Hit enter. And your work is saved. If you notice that you made a mistake up here, you can easily fix it. Just click on the pencil to the right make your change hit enter takes you to the next line hit enter again it'll take you to the next line your work is saved as you go so you can do a couple of lines or the entire translation uh, it's up to you when you get down to the very bottom and you're on the very last line it's important to after you type make sure you hit enter so that the translation is absolutely complete. And again, if you didn't do the entire translation, when you go back to video at the bottom of the page and you go to the player, the language you're doing will be available. You can click on it and you notice we only did 6%. Let me turn the sound off and there's the lines I typed. That's it. It's that simple. So again, click on the language you need, type in your language, Select it, hit the translate yellow translate button, and you can continue where you left off if you like. And if there's a translation that's already completed but you want to edit, if it's open to the public, you can certainly go in and edit it as you go. Uh, that's it. That's how you translate on .sub. If you have any questions, you can always go to the help files on the, at the top right or send us an email at help at .sub .com. Thanks.